Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in again today. I am featuring another fall inspired look and today it is this dramatic eye that I have on. I really love these combinations of colors from my Morphe 35W palette. I've been loving that palette and it's perfect because it's warm tones, perfect for the fall. It's what I really like to work with anyways. And I just thought because I created this look yesterday and I really liked it that I would film it for you guys today while I have time. So if you have five or ten minutes out of your day where you want to take a look and see how I created this look, then please stay tuned. And if you haven't already, please remember to subscribe to my channel so you can stay up to date with all the future videos that I post. Now let's get into the tutorial. I'm going to start out with my NYX eyeshadow base in ESB01 and I'm just putting this all over the lid with a concealer brush. Once I'm done with that, I'm taking these two colors from my Morphe 35W palette and I'm taking them on a fluffy side of my brush and I'm going to put that all over the lid where I just put that eyeshadow base to ensure that there won't be creasing and that at all the colors will be smooth and blended together. Next I'm going in with this nice brown lighter tone shade and I'm going to dot this in the corner, outside corner and the crease of my eye with my fluffy brush. Then I'm going in with this deeper chocolatey brown shade and I'm going to be taking that same fluffy brush and concentrating this more on the lower portion of the outer corner of the eye and I'm really making sure to blend that in really well with this brush into the other colors. Next taking my MAC 217 brush I'm going into this more of a red brown shade and I'm concentrating that too on the very outside portion of the corner of my eye and working that way to deepen up the look. For this color, I am going to be putting this on the entire lid and I'm going to be blending that into the other colors I've just put on. And this is going to be a nice base for the next color. I'm taking this really, really pretty metallic-y brown shade and I'm taking this with a little bit of MAC Fix Plus on my brush and I'm taking a e.l.f. brush that was a dollar or something like that. And I'm taking this and I'm putting this all over the lid, concentrating this mostly on the inner portion, the middle rather than the outer section. Then I'm taking my MAC 217 brush again and really blending that out because there were some pretty harsh lines in the inner corner. Now with this eyeshadow that is also for my Morphe 35W palette, I am taking this and concentrating it on the inner portion again with some MAC Fix Plus, which I definitely squirted all over my face instead of the brush. So You can see I'm just lightly packing that on to the inner corner and blending it into the other metallic color that I put on. Now I just went in back with the original metallic color I went and put that on the middle and blended that into going back in with my MAC 217 brush again just to make sure everything is nicely blended out. Now I'm going back in with this lighter brown shade that I used earlier and I'm putting this on my lower lash line to tie everything together. Now I'm going in with the brown part and I'm just going to use this color on the outer portion of the eye. That way it doesn't totally close off my eye and make it look smaller. Now I'm going in with my Estee Lauder pure color and I think this is in dark brown and I'm putting this on the waterline. That way it gives a deeper, more rich, and to ensure that that's going to stay on my lid all day, I'm going to take this 
small tiny sealer brush from e.l.f. and dip that into that dark chocolate round shade that I was using earlier. And I'm going to set that eyeliner pencil. I'm going to be using my Benefit There Real Push-Up Liner and I'm just going to apply a thin line of this on the base of the lash line. I'm going to go in with a thin layer of my Dior Iconic Over Curl Mascara because I am going to pop on some falsies. I am using my Ardell Double F 205 Black Lashes and this dark colored Duo, Duo Glue. Popping these lashes on I feel like really brings the look together. And to finish the completed look, I'm going to mist myself with some MAC Fix Plus as usual. So here is the completed look. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I've really enjoyed this look the past few days that I've been wearing it, and I've got lots of compliments, so I really hope that you enjoy it too. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel, and I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye, guys.